Hi, I'm Malachi Greb, CEO and engineer of Elite Automation. So if you're having trouble accessing your web interface of some type of device that you're trying to log into, so basically you have a device that has a web interface on it and you need to type in your IP address to be able to access that web interface, but for some reason you're not able to access that, I'm gonna show you a quick little trick that will help you eliminate that issue. So right here, you will see we are able to log in, but I will, I'm just going to type it out. So I'll type in 192.168.127.253, enter. Notice we came onto the web interface. Here's the web interface for this particular device. But a lot of times it might pop up and tell you that it actually can't find it. And I'll show you what that looks like real quick. Let's go ahead and minimize that. Let's go disable. So if you don't have access to your web interface, you may get some type of error message that looks very similar to this right here. So one of the solutions for this particular problem is, so make sure your ethernet card enabled. Another thing is, if you have two network cards, especially if they have the same IP scheme, then your computer will almost always choose the network card that has internet access. So being that it'll always choose the one that has internet access, if you're accessing your web browser interface through your hardwired network card, but you have Wi-Fi capabilities on, an, on another card or internet access through another card, whether it be wireless or not, it'll want to choose the card that has the, the internet. So the way to go ab around that is to disable your card that has internet and then come over here back into your web browser interface and then go ahead and just hit enter. Boom, we're back on our web browser interface, we have it. So that should fix your issue if you're having issues logging in on your web browser interface. If you wanna see any more content like this or just overall any content related to industrial automation, that's what we do here on the Elite Automation YouTube channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and we'll catch you on the next one.